Good morning, everybody. Today we'll talk on the iodoform test. Ethanol, CH3, CH2H, contains this group, CH3, CO group. Ethanol contains the CH3, CO group. This group when present in molecule can be tested by performing what is known as the iodoform test. Iodoform has formula CHI3. Iodoform is a yellow solid. Iodoform is also known as triiodomethane. Tri because there are three iodo because of iodine, methane because there is one carbon atom. To perform iodoform tests or the triiodoform test, we make use of sodium hydroxide and also iodine. To perform the test we need iodine and sodium hydroxide. The reaction takes place at room temperature but sometimes a slight warming is required. Ethanol reacts with sodium hydroxide and iodine to give a yellow precipitate iodoform is formed. We say ethanol gives a positive triiodomethane reaction. Ethanol, ethanol, propanone, all these compounds give positive triiodomethane reaction. The compound such as ethanol contains the CH3 CHOH group which is oxidized by the iodine to CH3 CO group. Propanol already contains the CH3 CO group. This compound gave positive iodoform test. So if I take a small amount of ethanol, ethanol, propanol, I add sodium hydroxide And then shake. I add iodine it start forming. I warm for some time. A reaction takes place. CHI3 is formed slowly as a yellow precipitate. This is the iodoform test. It is used to test ethanol, ethanol, propanol compound which contains CH3 CO group or which forms CH3 CO group in the reaction. To test, to perform iodoform test, we take sodium hydroxide, we take iodine, we add to the solution, we warm slightly, we obtain 
a yellow precipitate, CHI3. This is the iodophobe test. Thank you for your attention. Goodbye. See you another time for another lesson.